consider a n plus 1 is equal to 1 divided by 1 plus 1 by a n for n is equal to 1 to 1 2 3 4 till 2009 where a n is 1 we have been given the value of a n as 1 find the value of a 1 into a 2 plus a 2 into a 3 plus a 3 into a 4 dot 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 and so on right now we have a 1 is equal to 1 I want to find what a2 is. a2 or we can rewrite it as a1 plus 1. So that's 1 divided by 1 plus 1 by a n is 1. Or this becomes 1 divided by 1 plus 1 that is equal to 1 by 2. Done. What is a3? a3 is nothing but a2 plus 1. Similarly 1 divided by 1 plus 1 by half, a2 is half. So 1 by half is 2, so that gives me 1 by 1 plus 2 is 1 by 3. So we see a pattern here, a1 is 1, a2 is 1 by 2, a3 is 1 by 3. Let's check it with the other one, a4 or a3 plus 1 is 1 divided by 1 plus 1 by 1 by 3. Or again 1 divided by 1 plus 3, 1 by 4. So we clearly see this pattern here. So a n is going to be automatically uh, 1 by a n. That's all. In that case, a 1 into a 2, we can call it as 1 into 1 by 2 plus 1 by 2 into 1 by 3 plus 1 by 3 into 1 by 4 till 1 by 2008 into 1 by 2009. Simple. Now, this is a typical uh, pattern that we have here. You see, this is 1 by 2 into 1 by 3 is nothing but 1 by 6. Or we can clearly rewrite this as 1 by 2 minus 1 by 3 is equal to 1 by 2 into 1 by 3. Clearly, we multiply it, 3 minus 2 gives me 1, I am ending up with 1 by 6. So, we can call all of this 1 by 1 minus 1 by 2, plus 1 by 2 minus 1 by 3, plus 1 by 3 minus 1 by 4, 1 by 2008 minus 1 by 2009. Simple. The moment you figure this out, this becomes easy. So, minus 1 by 2 plus 1 by 2. Minus 1 by 3 plus 1 by 3. Minus 1 by 4 plus 1 by 4. Similarly, minus 1 by 2008, 1 by 2008. Goes off. I am left out with 1 minus 1 by 2009. Or subtracting this, you will get 2008 divided by 2009. Simple but effective way. So the answer is 2008 divided by 2009.